Well, today was pretty fun. Um, I came out on a little solo turkey hunt, and uh, this morning I forgot to turn the audio on the camera, so <clears throat> we'll voice over a lot of this. So I, um, I was shooting a few arrows, a few practice arrows this morning, and I walked out in the street. It's a rural country road in front of the property that I'm hunting, and I saw the turkeys coming down the street in my direction toward our property line. So I thought, well, there's a flock of them. They were on the other side of the road feeding and they fed over onto our side. So then I could chase them. So I got my stuff together and ran down through a creek wash and came up the other side. And they were kind of playing games with me. They came across and they went back across the road then they came across again. And so I got set up in a little nook in a corner where the cattle use a path to get through the creek. And I was hoping the turkeys were gonna use that same trail, but um, no such luck. They went a different way, so I got back in the creek bed and ran along until I found where they were coming over. I popped up and they saw me, so I had to get back in the creek bed again and go further to try to cut them off. And when I came around the corner, they were flying down into the creek. Turns out there's a little water hole still down there, and um, they were all watering. And I didn't know how many there were. I thought there were about 10 or 15. Turns out there was like 30 of them down in this creek bed. So I snuck up over the rocks. I think they're getting water down here right now. turkeys in there <laughs> and got a shot but it was a little far it was further than I probably should have shot um, it was about 30 yards and I'm using a traditional bow so uh, 30 yards is pretty far for me I'm a novice traditional hunter um, so I missed about two or three inches below the turkey I was shooting at and um, they all flew off so I circled around this big hill that they flew onto <clears throat> and <clears throat> raced them up. And by the time I got up the back side of the hill, they had already gone past where I could have gotten to them into the neighbor's property. So <sighs> it was fun though. They'll spot you from a mile, <laughs> but um, it's good practice. We're going to be going to Arizona here in uh, the near future, first of the year, to do a, um, a mule deer and javelina hunt. And I plan on trying to take a javelina with my bow. I was hoping to get my first blood with it uh, today, but maybe I'll come back out for another turkey hunt before the season's over here in a week or so and try again. Probably set up a blind though this time. So anyway, uh, thanks for following along today and uh, we'll see you on the next video.